Code 264, Pillow Talk by John Pierre Mier. Hi, Mark. I'm Dr. Tiffany Haven. Welcome to Pierre Sutton Haven. We're so sorry for your pain. Where's your wife? She should be here by now. Is that a noogie? What, what's a noogie? A noogie. A little something she does that gets on your nerves. Well, she's usually on time. I guess traffic or... Use the photographer. Hit the pillow and say, darn you! What's your wife's name, Dad? J.D. J.D. Darn you, J.D. Come on, say it. Darn you, J.D. Look, this really wasn't my idea. I only came because J.D. You're a little castrated, aren't you, Mark? Go with it. Hit the pillow and say, I do have guts. Why don't we wait until J.D. gets here? Does my saying this anger you, Mark? Hit the pillow and say, Darn you, Tiffany. Darn you, Tiffany. Darn you, J.D. Darn you, J.D. Hey, again. Darn you, J.D. Again, that's Darn wonderful. You, that's wonderful. Darn you, Darn you. Oh, you Darn do it. Do it. Mark, give her the baton. No. Mark. See, look at a man like this, 
and I'm consumed with jealousy. See, I could murder you. I could kill you. But I could also love you. And I don't even know your name. Roger, you can't do it. I'm really not that good at loving anyone myself. Yeah, well, he's boring, unimaginative. The spigot hurts his back. He's, he's one big nookie. I don't love you, Roger. <laughs> Look, don't take it personally. I can't get to anything about love because I don't love you. <laughs> well, at least that's all cleared up. <laughs> he's a cold hearted. Shout. He can't love you. But we can. Together. <laughs> well, I guess this is goodbye then. It's all my fault. I know. I just fell in love with the wrong person. Well, bye. <laughs> <laughs>